Over half a million lambs are slaughtered in Italy at the end of each year to meet the holiday demand alone. Many of them are raised in Eastern Europe and transported by truck to Italian slaughterhouses. Since 2018, Animal Equality has been documenting the many violations occurring during these live transports. Lambs are forced to make grueling journeys that can last days. We found trucks with lambs piled on top of each other, crushed and left without food or water. We documented lambs that were dead or dying due to the conditions in which they had to travel. Once again, at the end of the year, our investigation team worked day and night together with Animal Welfare Foundation and ENPA to expose the suffering of these young animals transported over the holiday season. We reported several trucks to the authorities en route from Hungary, Poland, and Romania, heading to Italy through the Slovenian border. Two of these trucks were stopped by law enforcement. The first truck inspected found crowded lambs arranged on four levels crying out in distress. They had been traveling for hours. The outside temperature was 33 degrees Fahrenheit. These lambs look so young they may not have even been fully weaned and all were showing clear signs of physical stress. The second truck inspected by authorities was also crowded with lambs, crying out in distress, confusion, and fear. The temperature inside the truck was 42 degrees, just barely above the minimum temperature allowed by law. These young animals have been torn from their mothers, and with transport trucks not equipped with drinking troughs, it makes it very difficult for unweaned lambs to endure these long journeys without feeding. European law prohibits the infliction of unnecessary suffering on animals. This includes the suffering and even death of lambs during their transport to be slaughtered. All the animals that travel on these trucks will face the same fate, slaughter. Over the years, we have documented regulations ignored and violations often going unpunished. This is the reality that over half a million lambs face at the end of every year in Italy. Though the demand for lamb meat has dropped over the years, thanks in part to the work of animal equality, too many lives still suffer in these difficult conditions. We will continue to document and expose these injustices to the public, to the judicial authorities and European institutions because too little is being done for these animals. This January, the European Parliament will vote on a series of measures recommended by a commission of inquiry that investigated the transport. We now have the opportunity to get a full revision of the transport regulation. Animal equality will continue to pressure institutions and work tirelessly until we achieve lasting protections for these animals by changing a senseless and cruel transportation system that inflicts unnecessary suffering on millions of individuals each year.